or just above the waist underneath your bust line. You can make the jumper look cropped by tucking it in under a belt. And welcome back to my channel. Do you have a dress that absolutely makes you feel like a million dollars and you just want to wear it every day just because of how flattering it is on you and how good you feel like when you're wearing it? Well, let me show you how you can wear that dress every day for a whole month and never get tired of the dress or double up on an outfit. I'm just going to show you this dress. I bought it from Portman's. If you're not in Australia, it's, it's an Australian boutique. Today I'm going to show you in black what it looks like. I'm currently wearing it with just black accessories and gold jewelry just to show you the dress in its full glory without distractions of accessories. But if you just swap out the simple black accessories with a pop of color, the whole look changes. And let me show you. it a little bit more casual and swap out the gold hoop earrings change them out for something a little bit more on tone like these dangly ones and when I wear dangly earrings I like to remove any necklaces just so that the neck can be emphasized and there you go dangly earrings but let's do something a little bit more daring and throw on a pop of extra color on the top on top dang the earrings and if you want to make it a little bit more walking friendly then just swap out the pop of color of heels into sandals and voila now you have that second option of wearing the same outfit with a pop of color by throwing on a shirt throwing on a crossover bag and some casual comfortable sandals in a matching color they don't have to be exactly the same and these Tommy Hilfiger sandals are actually tan white red and blue but from a distance the colors all blend together and they actually give the illusion of being pink and now you can go for a walk your hands are free if you want to do a little bit of shopping your feet are comfortable because you're wearing flat shoes so you can walk forever and your shoulders are covered so if you're in the sun you're also protected win-win you can't go wrong with this outfit if pink is not your color, then let's change it to something a little bit more neutral. Throw on a neutral shirt, tie it up at the waist or just above the waist underneath your bust line. I like to tie a knot, but I don't like the ends dangling loose like that. So what I do is I tuck them under to create a more seamless look. Now, I could keep these sandals on or change them out to espadrilles. If color is not your thing and you want something a bit more neutral, let's pop out of these colorful earrings and let's swap in something a little bit more neutral like these dangly ones instead. To protect our head from the sun, pop on a hat and let's grab a neutral bag. You can also change out the heel espadrilles into some cream colored walking shoes and create a more comfortable look geared to doing some serious walking. And there you go. Another look, simple, more friendly for walking, but still covering the shoulders, still wearing the same dress. I think I'm losing count of how many outfits. Let's count at the end. If you're living in a cooler climate where it's actually a little bit colder at the moment, then I've got you covered as well. You can still wear this dress. It does have some hefty weight to it, so it will keep you warm. So let me just try throwing on a jumper and show you how you can wear this dress in winter also. These are my favorite boots. I cannot wait to wear them some more come next winter. Throw on a jumper and you could wear it loose like this. Roll it up all the way to the top to, to keep your neck nice and snugly warm. Ah, please excuse the makeup, but you could wear it rolled up high like this with matching color boots. Throw on a belt, grab a bag and voila, nice and toasty. You can make the jumper look cropped by tucking it in under a belt. Throw on a necklace. Let's flip this dress around. The dress is flipped and now you have a completely different neckline with the back having a bit of a drop look to create a little bit more interest for a date night perhaps.
change out the accessories now. Add some pearls. Add some heels. Add a shiny bag. And you're all set for an evening out. Do you want to turn this look into an office attire? Let's go. Throw on a shirt underneath with an interesting collar. You can remove the necklace actually. Let's do that and show off the collar of this shirt. And voila, office appropriate too. But let's not stop there. Let's swap out this shirt for now a casual look. Let's throw on our casual sandals, grab a chambray shirt, tie it up the front, creating a jacket, tuck the ends under, roll up the sleeves, change out the earrings for something a little bit more fun and droopy, and throw in a bag. And voila! Feel like wearing some high heel sandals? Got you covered. Want to swap out the chambray shirt for a jean jacket? You can do that too. And now let's change it up to something a little bit more dressy again. I personally love throwing on a blazer over anything. I just find it immediately dresses up an outfit and elevates it a hundred times. And you can't go wrong with a classic cut blazer. Into this adorable two-toned pumps. Change out the earrings again. And you can wear this with a simple clutch or something a little bit bigger. And if you don't want to wear high heels for whatever reason, I've also got flatties for you. Let's try some out. And now let's go back to some more winter combinations. How about a high neck jumper tucked under a belt? And let's change the flatties into some boots. Throw on a little bit of bling. Grab a bag and voila! by the number of jumpers that you have in your wardrobe. And let's try a couple more colours, shall we? Grey, green, orange, maroon, blue, red, and pink. If you'd like to accessorize with neutral tones, here's another look for you. If you'd like to make something a little bit more fun but yet still look pulled together, how about this look? Shall we try black and white? again and try it with these gorgeous burgundy and cream shoes. Change it out into something a little bit more funky with, with this snake print booties. some more ideas for summer wear let's try some summer outfits let's throw on some slides throw on a white shirt throw on a hat and grab a bag and we're set and if you want to tie it up you can always do that 
don't want a jean jacket. As you can see, when you have a dress that makes you feel like a million dollars, really, the sky's the limit with how you can wear it and accessorize it. Please let me know in the comments below which one was your favorite outfit. Do you like it back to front? Or do you like it with the V at the front? Do you like it with a jumper in a winter style? Do you prefer it in a summer look? So many options. I could go on forever, I think, but I've definitely shown you that you can wear this one dress a whole month straight in a row, Monday through to Sunday, without duplicating a look. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing if you're new. I'd love for you to stick around and watch some more videos. And I'll see you next time. Bye.